Describing what it is to be um, an information management officer in the field is not something easy because maybe your first or your second deployment, it's always about getting out of your comfort zone. It's about always about uh, leaving your home, leaving your family or your friends and getting in a completely new environment. Um, it's about going somewhere where you have no clue how it works, where you, you don't know what's going on and trying to make sense of it all. So it's a blank page and the challenge will be for you to make sense of it, to create sense, to understand how it works, to understand who does what, where, who has responsibility, who do you have to deal with, uh, to negotiate with, to discuss with. And I believe this is, this is at the core of the challenge of being an information management officer in the field. It is what makes it so challenging, but at the same time, um, so rewarding at the end of the day. So on the content itself of the tasks of um, an information management officer in the field, it's not easy to describe uh, what it means. First of all, because uh, we're in the middle of an emergency and that means that the key word will be adaptation. There is no uh, one single way of doing our job. Our job is about adapting to what comes. So of course, there is an important part of um, dealing with data. Um, we receive data, we gather them and we organize them. So it means that we have to be quite comfortable with Excel, uh, we have to play around with pivot tables, um, but it also means that uh, we have to make sense of very dry information we receive. And this is a bit the second aspect of um, the very simple understanding of the job. Uh, making uh, the information we receive understandable, making sense of it. Uh, we have to make sense of it in order to be able to share the relevant information with the partners, but also with um, the WFP, with um, the global community and the global cluster, and also with donors. And this can be done through reports, of course, through social media posts, through funding proposals, and through uh, a lot of very different documents that we have to be able to um, create. It requires a lot of creativity, of course. But I believe that um, this dimension of the work, uh, this very classic understanding of what an information management officer uh, does, is not the full picture. The full picture is also what we have to do on the day-to-day, -day, what we have to answer uh, just because the crisis asks us to answer to. It means um, answering a request from a partner, it means uh, supporting uh, the WFP in a task or in an operation, it means supporting the cluster coordinator as well. It means globally um, filling gaps and going where we are needed. And to me it's the most interesting part and the most important part of um, our job, of what it means to be uh, an information management officer.